What is going on here? Uh, anyways, have you guys tried the scatterbush shrimp? <sighs> have you guys tried the scatterbush shrimp spaghetti? It's so good. We're gonna try to make it without the capers because the capers are sold out. I don't get. I don't understand how they're sold out. But we're gonna make it without the capers. it because i was just like whatever you guys have seen me get my hair done like so many times but yeah i basically got stitch braids i just woke up from a night out i'm so exhausted i'm so i'm tired i'm actually gonna do my facial right now i don't even know did i tell you guys about this new tool that i've been using to help you know just tighten my face up because you know you guys we gotta get rid of the double chin yeah so basically what it does is that it sends um, pulsations to the face and what I've been doing is like five strokes this way five strokes that way um, doing my um, cheekbone and sometimes I do touch my forehead but mostly just focusing on like the chin area but I'm using their serum but you can use a water-based serum if you have one um, but you just need to make sure that your face is obviously washed clean um, and it's like free from oils so I'm gonna do that today I'm gonna spend two minutes on my little at-home facial uh, just for reference i actually got the bare one they do have a few other ones um you might have heard of the one um i don't remember what it's called right now but it, it, it the, the purpose of it is to exfoliate so this one is mostly just for tightening and toning of the skin and making sure that you know you get that little facial lift um but obviously it's not overnight you need to keep doing it so yeah i'm excited to show you guys the results because i've already seen some improvements tomorrow i'm actually going to a foot locker event so i'm going to take you guys along with me i'm really excited it's actually in partnership for women's month or women's day sorry so i'm really excited to go and meet other creators network um so yeah i'm going to take about a few pumps of the serum i'm just gonna apply it on my face sometimes you do kind of feel it like i kind of feel it when i get to like more like areas where there's um i don't want to say inflammation but just more areas that are probably sensitive um so that would be like more of like my under eye cheekbone but i'm gonna actually do microcurrent at eight i think i did eight yesterday um and i'm gonna keep the t-sonic on so that's basically the pulsations and i'm just gonna glide I love the vibrating feeling. <laughs> you guys know what I mean. I use the bear on this side. And then look how like puffy this side looks. So we're gonna do the side next. If you have any questions, you can definitely leave them down in the comments below. And let's continue off the vlog. So today I woke up to this affirmation book that I got sent to me. Um, I believe her name is Bintu. She's actually from Montreal and she created this self-care book um, and it's just so beautifully written. I'm actually trying my best to get back into journaling in this format instead of actually just writing down my thoughts. But, you know, this is something that you might want to use if you're somebody who is trying to stick to affirmations, trying to stick to goals and uh, goal setting. So... 
you know, it really highlights, you know, some of your happy moments, some lessons that you've learned throughout the day, and a checklist that basically covers a lot of different feelings that you could have felt for the day. So I love that it even asks you how could you improve your day, but this is so nice. Like, I love how it's written. There's a lot of, you know, quotes um, and a whole bunch of pages that literally can probably last you for a full year, if I'm being honest. I wonder how many pages this is actually I didn't look but yeah um, if you're somebody who's looking for a new journal and um, is looking to support something that's black owned um, you should definitely check out just Zenit I will actually in include it in the description below it's a brand new day quick outfit of the day I got my vintage top on for my mother do you actually like it oh thanks Jalen and then I got these um, jeans from Princess Polly. I'm actually partnering with them in the next vlog, or next video, I should say, um, on a try on haul. My hair is in this like long braid. I don't know if I'll keep it like this just because the ends are not like boiled. Like I didn't actually sort of boil it because I was in a rush. So I was like, you know, um, just put it in a little bun. So I had it like that for a long time, but now I'm like, maybe it'll look cute like this. But yeah, and yeah. So I'm on my way. To meet Kalea, we're gonna go watch Batman, and then we're gonna go eat, and then I might go out later, we don't know. But I gotta cook and clean chicken, and I gotta do a lot of stuff, so it's gonna be a busy weekend. One thing about me, <laughs> one thing about me, I'ma be late. <laughs> hey, Kalea girl. <laughs> but, okay, now you're confusing me. You, you said, I don't want to. You don't but... want to, and then you created an Instagram page. Yeah, okay, so, okay, so, so this is okay. So on my mind, I'm like, you always just like, no, like, listen, this is like a little space inspired, like, Hyra. Yeah, Hyra, the Atlanta like, girl. Yeah, like, you know, like, your classy, yeah. shape, like, that's what I'm trying to let you know. Yeah. So you never with it? <laughs> <laughs> it's true, and you know it's so funny because like neither would I. But uh, yeah. for me, like the best thing was like looking at like Pinterest yeah. or like looking at like girls. Are you rolling up right now? No. Oh, I, I need you, guys, you guys, you guys, you guys. Look at this girl. <laughs> like when you're from the hood, you know. <laughs> when you're from Little Burgundy, you know. I kind of want a beer. Like I don't want like. I don't want no, no, okay, tell me how do yeah. you get into beer, because beer is that. You know what, I started with a beer that I ended up liking, which was Cronenberg Blanc. That beer was like such a, a good tasting beer, it almost was like, um, like a fizzy Sprite, mm -hmm. but like, you could taste this a beer, because it's not fully like yeah. a beer beer. Like I would never order like a Heineken or like yeah, I used to get into that. Like even when I was younger, I used to sip on it. Like if yeah. I could see my like, yeah, uncle, that, yeah, yeah, you hit like. Mm, that looks so good. I'd be like, is she sitting with someone? <laughs> You guys already know I had to get me a little steak and I'm waiting for my uh, margarita. Mm. I love margaritas, you know. I think it's something about the salt. You're not in the place. No, it's a blonde girl. Ooh, thank you. Thank you. Ice cream? Okay. I'm about to tear it. I don't know how the hell you had room for this because low key, I never ordered dessert when I'm out. We better hurry up though because the these shits turn soggy. Right. Hopefully you guys can hear me, but I just finished my yoga session. It was about an hour and a half, and now we're here just networking and mingling with people. I got a fresh pressed juice, and now I'm gonna head home and make some food. Um, but yeah, it was a really nice experience. So happy that I came here, um, and I also got a gift from Foot Locker. I'm gonna show you guys when I get home. So yeah, talk to you guys when I get home. Hello, beautiful people. Um, just got back home from the Foot Locker Village event. It was actually really, really fun. I feel so like, I feel so like stretched out. <laughs> like my body feels like it just definitely like needed that. Like it's been a long time since I've like been to any type of um, like collective community type of like organized fitness anything. Cause as you guys know, we've been in a pandemic and everyone has just been able to work out uh, in their own home. So yeah, it felt really, really nice. Just for a little time lapse, 
today is actually daylight saving which means i lost an hour of sleep so technically i've been up since five but in the realm of everything it's it was technically six um it's currently 10 35 right now it's actually an hour earlier it finished an hour earlier but i have some goodies here uh first and foremost this juice called B Vibe Juicery, very very good. It literally tastes like my natural juicing, and I always like I always think about how how fresh things are because like when I'm juicing, I'm obviously juicing from the fruits and vegetables. Like I'm not adding any sugar, so the fact that like this tastes exactly like how my juicing tastes in my fridge right now, um, it just goes to show like okay, like people are actually not adding random sugars and stuff. So. Um, mm really really good i also stopped at cops to get some donuts i've been to this place before you guys have seen it in my vlog before actually let me go wash my hands what am i doing Ew! okay i'm back um i i don't know how i, I even had that moment it's, um i went to cops and i got some donuts um you guys have seen me go here before the girl just dashed them in here like i wanted to literally take a picture and i'm like babe like you couldn't put it in here cute it's not even aesthetically pleasing. It just looks mash up. So, mm, so good. That one is the um, the cream cheese one, and then this one is like the cinnamon one. I got that, and then I got a gift card from Foot Locker as well. I haven't opened it yet. It could be like maybe a hundred bucks. So yeah, that was really nice of them as well. Today is one of those days where I'm just like, because I woke up so early, I'm exhausted. So I know I have homework to do. I have some like editing and stuff to do. Um, I have a Shea Moisture video coming out this week. So I need to like finalize the way I want that video and everything to look. And then I need to edit a TikTok that's going to go out tonight. And then I need to do some homework, like work that I literally have to do for school. And then I want to watch that cute little like movie that just came out on Disney Plus, like the one where she turns into like this this bear or whatever i don't know what it's called it's called big red or something i want to watch that tonight so i'm probably not going to pick up my vlogging camera until maybe sometime this week because i'm supposed to get a package from revive revive foods i think that's what it's called it's like a membership subscription based like food thing where like they have like fresh fruits uh not fresh fruits are like frozen smoothies and then they have like frozen meals and like everything is supposed to be like just like on the go like that's the whole like premises of like their whole like subscription thing so i'm supposed to get a couple stuff from them and i actually am really excited to to try it and i totally freaking forgot they gave me a yoga mat it says foot locker inside of it but i like wrapped it up all like funny looking because like i had so many bags i had my purse i had this i had that i was like i need to i hate being the bag lady so yeah they gave me a yoga mat which is so funny to me because i wanted a yoga mat for years but every time i had to do like any type of exercise that required a yoga mat it was always provided for me so i didn't really care to get one and then when the pandemic hit or technically it's still here but like ending whatever when it like happened i was just working out on like my carpet like i just it never really i never cared to like actually own a yoga mat but i know that i always wanted one if that makes sense yeah now i have one it's from Foot Locker. it's great quality it's black too which i really like because i hate i hate like funny prints like i hate shit like that i'm like great solid color we're good So, um, so I just finished a job interview. Um, one thing about me, if the interview is 15 minutes, I'm not putting on makeup. <laughs> Beer face and all, I'm not doing it. I'm so sorry. You never met me before, so technically you don't even know how much I can beat this face. And I'm not beating it for 15 minutes. Absolutely not. So, now I'm like still fresh faced. <sighs> it went really well um i am currently still in internship season but like what's so messed up about it is just like humber is about to go on strike now and this is like the second time that i've been in school and the school went on strike like aren't you guys tired like two years in a pandemic babe what are we doing why are we struggling this hard like this is just too much for me and it's snowing you guys like look i don't want to show my oh well you can't really see where i live but anyways look at this it's like March 15th, but like honest to God, we always get like this random, um, like random last snowfall. So I feel like this is normal, but it just feels a lot because just yesterday was day or two days ago was daylight savings. 
Um, sorry, I'm like crooked. Just two days ago, it was daylight savings, um, which kicked me in the ass, to be honest. Actually, the first day, it kicked me in the ass, so it was like the Saturday. The Sunday, I got used to it, but like I was still really, really tired. Um, it's 11.25 right now. I actually have class at 11.40. I have so much stuff to submit today, and I'm just like, do I submit it? Because y'all on strike, or do I just live my best life? But I'm going to try a smoothie now. I changed my mind. I was gonna do the strawberry banana smoothie, but then I just figured like I'm hungry. And then I kinda want something else, like maybe like something coffee-ish. So let's just do that instead. I'm gonna go get it. I forgot to do an unboxing for you guys on YouTube, but I did do an unboxing for TikTok. It's like food to like ice cream to smoothies. That was all the exercise for today. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna do the morning mocha. This one has, um, what does it have, y'all? Bananas, cauliflower, like where do they get this? Anyways, avocado, cacao, uh, pea protein, coffee, and cinnamon. So I only make sense because I haven't had my coffee today. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do that and then, I don't know if I wanna end the vlog here because I have this like really random clip of when I went out with my influencer friend. I call her that just because like I don't, she doesn't know that I'm make, putting her in the vlog like this, but I might just end the vlog after that influencer clip, but if it feels if it feels weird, that's I'm, I'm letting you guys know now. Oh my God, this smells like straight cinnamon. Why am I nervous in a market like this one? But it has bananas in it, so I feel like it'll be okay. To be honest, you guys, like anytime I go to Starbucks or something, like I don't ever get mochas. Like I'm not a huge fan of like chocolate drinks, even though I love chocolate. Like I'll take chocolate over like anything, but something about like just drinking a drink that's chocolate, like chocolate ice cream, like who? I'm judging you, like I'm severely judging you if you like and enjoy chocolate ice cream. Like I just, I love chocolate, but that's, that's where I draw the line. So to have a chocolate smoothie, I'm just like, oh my god, am I gonna like this? God damn! Um, how do I do this again? Oh. Okay. You guys ready? I feel like this is wrong. Oh my god, y'all. Not me forgetting the blade. <laughs> I'm actually annoyed because why am I like this? Okay, so basically I have to put this now in a different container. a little OOTD. I'm actually going out with another influencer friend. We we're going out for breakfast at this place called Old School. Um, and I'm really excited because I have like really good pancakes. Um, like really funky type of like pancakes. Um, and yeah, her name is Aaliyah. I'll show you guys her when I get there. She's like super cool. Um, so yeah, let's go downtown. Ooh, you guys, look at this. Please tell me how we're eating. <laughs> <laughs> My, our eyes are too big. <laughs>